Whenever I meet a new NPC in Elden Ring, my first thought is always when can I kill you and steal your clothes. With White Mass Beret, that urge to murder and then wear his face arrived very quickly. But when I finally did exterminate this jerk, all I got was his weird flower hammer. Luckily, I figured out how to get Beret's mask so you too can look this stylish. And creepy, I'm Jamie Latour, and this is where to find the White Mask in Elden Ring. To get your hands on this mask, you need to reach the Mogwin Palace region. I previously covered how to get here in my last video, and that's linked below in the description. But to sum it up quick and easy, you get here by either completing Vare's questline or using a portal that's found here in the Consecrated Snowfield. Where we need to go is this big, bloody lake. It's easier to get here by using the Snowfield portal, as it will warp you near a site of grace that's close to the shore of the Blood Lake, but it may take you a while to reach this late game area and we want that creepy white mask right now. You can get to the lake by using the Pure Blood Knight's medal that you get from Vare, but you will need to get by these red albaneric guys with devil horns first. They themselves aren't too tough, but they summon gigantic ghost skeletons that can be a pain, especially if you're below level 90, which is about the recommended level for this region. Thankfully, you can sneak by them by hugging this wall over to the right until you reach that lovely bloody lake. Be be careful around here if you're underleveled as there's a ton of tough red bloody albanurics, angry bloody dogs, huge bloody birds, and some bloody geysers. Once you're here, explore around the lake and you should eventually get invaded by NPCs known as Nameless White Masks. These guys look just like Vare, although at no point do they laugh at you and call you Maidenless. The Nameless White Masks can be difficult opponents as they use daggers that do bleed damage and will perform the Swarm of Flies incantation to inflict even more bleed damage. Guys, come on. I only have so much blood. There are three nameless white masks who can invade your world. However, it seems like the one who will drop the white mask is located at this spot on the map. You need to kill this specific invader to score the white mask and the War Surgeon armor set. Keep in mind that if you kill this region's boss, Moog, the Lord of Blood, then these NPCs will no longer spawn and you can't get this mask. Now you may be asking, why am I going out of my way to get a mask that makes me look like this douche? Well, the white mask is actually a really good piece of headwear if you're running a bleed build, as it will give you a 10% attack power buff when you inflict any kind of bleed damage on an enemy. Of course, the downside to this buff is that you need to walk around looking like Vare, but as long as you don't mind calling people maidenless, that shouldn't be a problem. For more Elden Ring news and guides, check out thegamer.com. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.